One of the many powerhouse performances last night at the CMA. She did that with the hosting with Brad. It was really unforgettable. And Lara was there for it all. Lara, I told you you'd have a great time. I was right, huh? <laughs> Robin, I mean, you yeah. are so right. Yeah. Greetings, guys, from Broadway in downtown Nashville. This was amazing. A galaxy of stars, not all from planet country, though. We're talking movie stars, legends coming together to celebrate the 50th anniversary of the CMAs. Moment after moment to sing along. Jennifer Garner was here, Sharon Stone, Matthew McConaughey, all to witness a tremendous tribute to the great Dolly Parton and watch a foot stomping performance by country newcomer, Beyonce. With his gun, with his head held high, he told me that the surprise guest Beyonce brought down the house. <laughs> Joining the Dixie Chicks for a foot stomping rendition of Daddy Lessons off of her Lemonade album. Not exactly country, but the star studded audience erupted out of their seats. Dolly is country music, pure and simple. Working nine to five, I walk away, make a living, barely getting by. It's all taken and no giving. Here you come up. Just what I'm about to make it work without you. Which is why it was only fitting to have not one, but five of country's biggest female superstars from different generations pay homage to the one and only Dolly Parton. All five ladies singing, I will always love you. of country then honored with the Willie Nelson Lifetime Achievement Award. For me to be receiving the uh, Willie Nelson Award, <laughs> this is an absolute high for me. <laughs> Taylor Swift electrified the crowd in this black and nude gown as she presented the Entertainer of the Year Award. And the CMA Award for Entertainer of the Year goes to Garth Brooks. We are so damn lucky to be part of this thing called country music. He was so, so happy. And Dolly was saying she was trying so hard not to cry during that incredible performance, that tribute, because she didn't want to ruin her makeup, of course. <laughs> and good morning, Bar Garth. I'm sure you're still up. Hopefully still celebrating the record fifth win for Entertainer of the Year. So well deserved. And guys, as we wake up here in Nashville, excuse the trucks behind me, but we have more for you. At 8 o'clock, you'll hear from more stars of the night, more winners, and Nicole Kidman, who was, of course, there with Keith Urban, who revealed to me a secret about herself that turns out we have in common. It was quite a moment. Poor Keith Urban is all I'll say. Okay. And we'll show it to you coming up. You're good with those teases there. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> quite a moment to Robin. Be. I know. It's been a couple years, but Robin, I got to tell you. Yeah. Robin, I love this town. You were right. Nashville, uh -huh. I'm, I'm voting the nicest town in America. Yeah. Whoa. I'm My telling favorites. you, yeah. they roll out the red carpet and they are so hospitable. And that award show, it's about the music. Yep. And because of the game and people are going yep. back and forth, I believe that they have all the performances on our website. Excellent. All oh, on, on, yes, they put them all online so people can see it. And we can't wait to see more of Lara's backstage access at the CMA Awards. I'm glad she had a good time.